Hey all, my name is Paul Borowski and I am the owner of Quality Business Plan. And what I'd like to do today is introduce you all to my cleaning company business plan template. So in this video, what I'm gonna do is first and foremost, give you a little bit of background about me, who I am, what I do and why I do it. From that point in time, we're then going to dive into the Word portion or the Word document portion of my cleaning company business plan template. I do have an Excel file, that's the financial model that's included in the cleaning company business plan template, but I go over that in a separate tutorial. All right, so with that said, foundation set, let's go ahead and mosey on down this path of completing this little PowerPoint presentation that I've got designed for your listening and viewing pleasure. Again, my name is Paul Broski, owner of Quality Business Plan, also MBA. I am a professional writer, specifically a business plan writer. If you all want to avoid all the growth opportunities, the fun and excitement of writing your own cleaning company business plan, just pick up the phone, give me a call, send me a text, send me an email. I'd be delighted to write that business plan for you. I am also an author of numerous books published on Amazon.com and yep, 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 they are also focused on business plan writing. And then finally, I am an adjunct professor and subject matter expert in, um, in both business and finance. So if your business plan is all set, ready to go, but those um, projections, those financial numbers are giving you some problems, again, be delighted to do those for you. All right, infomercial is done. Here is the star of the show. This is the word portion or word document portion of the business plan template for the cleaning company. And here say, hi, this is the Excel file or the financial model. So on this, once you open up the word document portion, um, you're going to be confronted with the title page. On this page right here, you can go ahead and just put your company name right here, or you can go ahead and put your logo right here, completely up to you. The next page could be your table of contents and the table of contents once you add a little bit more meat to the bone then what you can do is you can go ahead and update the table you just click on update table click on update entire table click on ok and once you've added your information here then it'll update with the titles and also the page numbers the next section is your executive summary section in this section you're going to see the cleaning company summary your target market your financial highlights and then your funding request all the places in yellow, I recommend you change, um, but definitely read through the document and make sure it's, it meets your criteria and it's, it's saying what you want it to say. Now, when you do get to the financial, um, per, the financial highlights, we do, we do need to pull some numbers out of the financial model. So make sure you complete your financial model. And once you've filled out all your information in this section right here on the information page, you're gonna go to the projections t um, tab, and then you're gonna want these three numbers right here. And what you'll be able to see is that these numbers align. So for your um, revenues, it aligns with the first number and then expected cost aligns with the second and then your net profits aligns with the third number. All right, the next section is gonna be the company description section. In this section, we've got a place right here for your company summary, services provided. Then we've got your uh, competitive advantages. I give you a starting point here. But again, feel free to adjust it as you see fit. Next section, I give you a brief start to your um, primary target market. Also, we have included in here a pricing strategy, hours of operation, location, describe your office if you're going to have one. And then finally, I give you a little snippet of a strategic plan included in the business plan, just to give the reader an idea of what you want to accomplish in your first three, six, um, three months, six months, and 12 months. Next is the industry analysis. This has already been done. This information was summarized from IBIS World as well as other sources. Next section is going to be the SWOT analysis, strength, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. On this section right here, it is smart art. So what you'll do if you want to um, change the information or update it, you click on the smart art. And then what you'll do is you see this little tiny little arrow right here. You want to click that little tiny arrow and out pops another menu. And right here, you can go ahead and update the information as you see fit. Next section is gonna be the organizational structure. This is your legal structure, who's the owner, what kind of um, company it's going to be, and so on. And then this again, we're into the, some little bit of smart art with your organizational structure, just to let the reader know visually how your business is gonna be structured. Next section is going to be the marketing section. Traditionally, cleaning companies are going to do traditional marketing, internet marketing, social media marketing. And so I've given you a starting point for each one of those. All you got to do is either leave it, the way, leave it as is or expand upon it with your own information. 
Next section is going to be your funding request. How much money do we need to get this party started? Um, right here, you're going to put the dollar amount of the money um, funding needed. Here are the terms. How long of a loan are you going to need? And here are the interest rates you expect. The final section is going to be our financial projections. Um, we've got financial projections that for year one is broken into monthly and quarterly segments. Month one through three, quarter one. Month four through six, quarter two. Month seven through nine, quarter three. And then month 10 through 12, quarter four. And then finally, we've got your annual projections for the next five years, years one through five. Now, once you update your financial model, then obviously these numbers are going to change. So what you're going to do, need to do is you're going to need to remove this income statement as well as your profit and loss statements. You'll need to go to the financial model. Once you've updated all your information on the information tab, you will then want to go to the profit and loss tabs and then also the income statement tab. And you're going to want to copy and paste the information. So we'll copy the income statement and we're going to want to paste the new information into the Word document. And it's as simple as copying and pasting and you're all set, ready to go. So yeah, that is the, um, that, that's my little magic trick there. And yeah, once you're done with that, you're all set, ready to go with your business plan. So time to wrap it up, sum it up and call it a day. So in summary, if you do like my uh, cleaning company business plan um, template, you can purchase it. Just go to my website here, qualitybusinessplan.com forward slash cleaning company business plan template. Uh, you can buy it um, and download it from that website. Now, when you, if you do, when you do buy the template, it does come with the Word document, which we just went through. And it also comes with the financial model and the financial model comes with a separate tutorial. There are some restrictions or limitations to my template. Uh, first and foremost, it is not compatible with Google Docs or Apple products. Also, I do not offer free phone support after you buy the template. If you've got questions about the template before you buy it, please feel free to pick up the phone, give me a call, me a text, send me an email. Be delighted to have a great conversation about my cleaning company business plan template, how it operates, what's in there, and so on. However, after you buy it, if you got questions, I will, well, you got a couple options. A, I can refer you, I will refer you to my um, business plan tutorials. These are free and you can access them right now to review them to make sure you like them at this website right here. Or I can fill in that template for you, but there is a fee for that. And then finally, if you don't want to mess around with a template and you don't want to mess around with writing a business plan yourself, you just want the darn thing done, then I would be delighted to write a custom business plan um, for you, for your, um, for your cleaning company. All you have to do is just go to my prices page right here. I've got several custom business plan packages available for purchase. All right. So hopefully this information was helpful. As always, uh, go out, make a little bit of money and have a great day. Thank you.